Guajataca Dam had not been updated since the 80s. And uh, what happened during the course of the storm is a normal output pipes jammed, and you still had a tremendous amount of water flowing into the reservoir behind the dam. The spillway functioned as it should, but it just hadn't handled this volume of water uh, up to this point. Such a volume of water came through so fast, and the spillway itself really had some uh, structural issues, and it undermined and ripped out the bottom half of the spillway, and thus is starting to erode back that spillway and the bottom of the dam. The foundation of that spillway is pretty much sand. If it erodes all the way up to the dam, you could be talking about a catastrophic failure of the dam, which would flood hundreds of families that live below the dam. So what you have happening on the ground, U.S. Marines are hooking up Jersey barriers to cables. Navy pilots come in with a big CH-53s. The Marines hook the barriers to the, uh, to the helicopter, and the helicopter pilots drop these at the foot of that spillway. In theory, what they're trying to do is build a big old pile of rocks to stop the erosion. It works in theory. The bad part of the equation is they're still getting more rain just about every day here. The Army Corps of Engineers is going to hook up some pumps and trying to uh, prevent what could otherwise be a catastrophe if that spillway erodes all the way up to the dam. Melissa? All right. Thank you for that report. We'll keep an eye on that.